Welcome back to another episode of Beho Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look back at one of the worst selling systems, but one of the most beloved by Sega, the Sega Dreamcast. We will take a look at my own collection that I own today and continue to still play time after time. This episode will be dedicated to my favorite genre growing up, the fighters. <laughs> Released in 1999 by Sega and developed by AM2, Virtual Fighter 3 was ported to the Dreamcast, one of the first games to realize an almost perfect arcade to home 3D conversion brought awe to what, what the actual system could do. Reviews were excellent, but came up a dud in sales due to a remastered Soul Calibur. This game still made waves in Japan and helped recoup their losses from Shenmue. Fighting Vipers 2 was also developed by AM2 and a Sega release in 2001. Although never receiving a North American release, it was released in Japan and Europe for those who imported the game, like myself. The graphics and gameplay alone warrants a playthrough and is a massive improvement from the original. The game is a straight port of the arcade and just getting by with the Virtual Fighter gameplay won't help you in this one. Let the action begin. Go! Project Justice is another port from the arcade original for the Dreamcast. Released in 2001, the sequel to Rival Schools, Capcom brings high school fighting in the 3D world with 2D gameplay. The game incorporates 3 on 3 with the team combos as well as the now popular air combos. Capcom then incorporated with X-Men vs Street Fighter. With this unique gameplay, this fighter is as addicting as Street Fighter game with insane combos and supers. <laughs> Soul Calibur remains the game that ruined all other 3D games for the Dreamcast. Released in 1999 as a day one title, no other game looked as good or played as good as Soul Calibur. The game's graphics rivals next-gen gaming on a PS2 before it even came out and still looks good today. The weapon-based fighting in 3D landscape helped push the fighting games to a new level of detail and overall quality. One fighter that should never be overlooked. Battle to fight! <laughs> <laughs> That's it for me on this episode of Beho Reviews. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and Gray, take us out of here. Damn.